Saturday, October 21st, 2017, we followed Waterford Union High School Theater Group to their competition play, hoping to find out just what a stage manager does. After finding out, we figured we might want to share it with you so that more people can be aware. Here's what we found. If you tried to go looking for the job description of a stage manager, chances are, well, you wouldn't exactly find what you're looking for because no one really understands what stage managers do. Running, lifting, jumping, some would say a high adventure for the metropolis and the occasional juice box. It's also about being the sheepdog when your flock is, frankly, 20 different places mentally. Sometimes there are problems in your way that you just have to pony up and deal with. Even if that problem is a giant U-Haul truck that you realize you don't have the keys to. So about that job description, the show must go up. Something you'll hear every stage manager say, or at least every director. When you find the cast or crew struggling with something, that's the time to jump in and improvise a little bit. Steer the group back to the direction that you need to be in so that the show can, in fact, go on. It's intense moments like these that things begin to come together, and that just puts a smile on your face. Speaking of smiles, being a stage manager isn't all work and no play. Sometimes, you just gotta kick back and enjoy yourself with your cast. Eventually, though, you've got to go back to work. As a stage manager, it is imperative that you work with the director. The director holds the vision of the show. That being said, sometimes while performing a job, the director needs someone to oversee other equally as important jobs. This is where the stage manager comes in. Acting as almost a second director, a stage manager makes sure that the whole thing continues to get done. This coordination with the director, as well as with the whole crew in general, helps to ensure that any show will run smoothly. Also, I can say, enjoy the show!